Hello, this is the attract mode of King of Fighters 2000 on a Neo Geo MVS. It's actually on my consolized Omega Neo Geo MVS. So I'm going to go ahead and take advantage of the built-in Unibios chip and uh, turn these babies on. I'm running the European, um, it's set to European territory, which I think handles one of these, but I always forget which one. So I just, I think actually it handles the blood. I, I don't know, anyway. Uh, so we exit this and we're good. So insert my imaginary coin and we'll let the CPU pick a team. Ugh. So that's Whip, Mary, Lynn, and Mai. So I don't like Whip, so I'm going to make her the striker. So it'll be Mary, Lynn, Mai, and Whip. Mary, Lynn, Mai. Okay. So now I reboot. Actually, I shouldn't have done those cheats because I'll have to do, redo those. So wait a second. Mary, er, uh, Mary Lynn, Mai, Whip. Uh, so, Mary, Lynn, Mai, and Whip is the striker. I forgot to, forgot to look at who her alternate striker is, so it's been a little while since I played, since I fired up the uh, Omega here and played some 2K. It's a... Relatively easy start though because Hinako is well hard to she's hard to use effectively in 2000 and the the AI is not very good with her usually. Your I you'll notice that I have this set to the highest difficulty which is eight. Uh, and the super meter is turned off. I just, I don't like supers. Plus, in these Neo Geo games, they tend to be, and they are in this, uh, just kind of flashy and sometimes feeling kind of photosensitive and not really into having those black screen flashes hit my eyeballs. Plus, I can never remember the darn super move inputs for everybody. But mostly, I just... I, I don't know. It's it, Mostly, it's the photosensitivity thing. Also, I just play bad when when I worry about getting a super in. Oh, no, I'm playing bad now. Bip, save me. Yeah. Save me again. Good job. Oh, no. Three, two, one. Uh, what happened? Okay. Man, she just came trucking in there. Hi, Lucky. Oh, wow. I was going to say, the CPU doesn't usually take an alternate color, but I forgot it. It, it does when you have that person on your team. Obviously. Ow! Okay, I don't know what I'm doing with Lin. He's too new. <laughs> he only came along in 2000. That was, you know, a mere 21 years ago. I'm not used to him yet. And he plays different than everybody else, so I don't know what to do. Yeah, you can wave your finger at me. Actually, I got lucky because Kasumi is by far the one I the one I have the most trouble with by far. So she's the striker. That's a break for me. Oh, stop it! Take care. So Whip's actually a pretty effective striker. At least, at least she gets a little hit in. Generally, doesn't necessarily do a ton of damage, I guess. Well, no, the strikers generally do, but unless you're good enough to. Uh, you know, use them to start a combo. 
I don't I don't usually do that. Here's the alternate color whip because of my striker. I do like that alternate color whip. That's actually pretty cool. Except the hair. The hair is silly, and the whole whip concept is silly actually. So I wish whip was not in the game. But as a striker, I, I guess she's okay. I just hate fighting her. I hate her screaming, her, her teleporting, her weapons. Uh, I mean, I guess I don't mind some characters with weapons. But the whip is obnoxious. Ah, this is going poorly. Well... He's just yelling. I... Dang it. Why? Why do they always get the hit in at the last second? Oh, I'm so bad. Well, oh, great. Oh, jumping was not the solution. What is that? Oh no. Oh gosh. Oh yeah. Oh, he went right through that. He's... Yeah, right. Oh, I think it's a uh, uppercut motion for his stabby stabby. Ooh, I kind of knew that. Okay, Mary, you only have to take out Ralph and Clark. No problem. You got two whips. What, what more could you need? Oops. Oh, no. Don't let him do that. Oh, shoot. Oh wow, this uh, this flamey spin move of hers is is pretty pretty effective against the AI. Probably more than it ought to be. Maybe they're just distracted by the bounce. Yep. Clark and Ralph love to come charging in. So this is kind of taking advantage of a relatively weak AI for these two. Oh no. Oh, I got this row in. Well, hot dang. Good job, my Bail this out. Stupid whip. I mean, their whip. I'm bad at fighting whips. Oh, Chris. Uh, he, can, he can wait. I don't like Chris either. <laughs> Are you ready? I don't know if I'm ready. I've been having a lot of trouble fighting Shingo lately. I, is it Shingo? I think it is. Maybe, well, maybe it wasn't Shingo. Oh! Oh shoot. Oh. You're welcome. Arigato. Uh oh, I don't really know Seth either. He's also too new. Hey. Oh. Oh no. Nothing's working. Help. Help whip. Please, new character is whip. Seth. Oh, gosh. He's got a counter. Of course, Seth and whip were strikers in 99. Ow. Jeez. I just ran into everything. Oh, this is bad.
Oh wow, he does a. I know. I don't think I ever really realized he does a counter first. He, he blocked with his forearm. Or starting the stabbies. Oh no. Ow, my face. Ow, my face. Come on. Come on. Come on. Aw, oh, shucks. Oh, no. Oh, he didn't get the last hit. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> Ow. Hi. Oh. Okay, well, it's not great. Dang it. Okay, Ma, you gotta bail us out again. Even odds should be alright. Oh. I don't like that dive kick of hers all the time. Sucker for that. Oh no, I got crushed. Should have saved it, I suppose. Oh, what the heck? Oh. Three hundred points. Is that enough for Kula? I don't remember. I think it. Yeah, there we go. So you get over three hundred, whatever points in a in a fight, and uh, you get to fight Kula. Um, on on level eight, it's pretty easy to get three hundred points because the points you get goes up by difficulty level. At at lower difficulties, I have a hard time getting a score of 300 and fighting Kula. And Kula is not usually too difficult. She's only one character. You've got three, so she can be tough. She's not usually... Oh, shoot. She's not usually three characters tough. Well, nice. Oh, she's not... Oh, she... This is not very good. I usually don't get beat up quite this bad by whip, but I still have two more characters. Ow. See, it's funny. She's got these friends, but they don't actually fight with her. Uh, oh, sometimes they're strikers or something. Oh, she was just taunting. Not uh, Ugh. Ah, well, this is poor. Okay, that's not working. Jeez. God, okay. Well, this is how you can blow it against. What? what was that move I did? Man. I only had to hit her a few times and I failed. Okay, well now we got fire and ice, so... I've totally blown my strikers. Alright.
I mean, uh, I hate it. So, sometimes I have that problem with uh, Kula. She'll just, I won't be able to touch her with a character. That was certainly the problem I had there with Lynn, and I I didn't do as well as I probably should have with Mary. Oh, well. Good enough. Thank, thank goodness for my and her spinny, flamey thing. Oh, jeez, I thought she was... I thought I had the drop on her there. Yeah, take that. Oh, shoot. Oh, wow. Oh, I hate that one. Arg! Jeez! Okay, I'm yelling now. Oh, God. Oh, God. She started hitting me with all her huge can combo moves because I'm a chump. Oh. Oh, dang it. Why was I. For some reason, I was hammering jab. I thinking. I actually view Rio as kind of a weird character like Lin. So maybe I can do something here. Uh, not so far. Oh no. Oh god. Well the old roll and Oh. Oh, what a mess this fight has been. Well, my here's another hole to dig your to dig us out of. Oh no, this is the worst one yet. I think. Thing. This is bad. Okay. Dang it. He was, he was not not getting flamed. Hey. I love this stage. This, this is one of my most favorite stages in any well, in any fighting game. Certainly in any King of Fighters game. Keep doing this until you stop it, Takuma. Uh oh, uh oh, he stopped it. Oh gosh. Ah. The heck is going? Oh no, that was stupid. Yep. Whoa. Oh, uh. oh boy, it's a good thing I saved up all my whips there. Yeah. Well, I made it to the finals. It's about all I can ask of myself because uh, I don't know how to beat that boss. <laughs> so, uh, so we'll hope to do well in the finals. If we get to the boss, bonus. If we beat the boss, super bonus. Yes, I set my my standards low. This music track works so well. It really helps tell this weird story. Drum beat. Touche. Yeah. Oh, 
one that it cuts, it gets cut out awkwardly. That final, final beat. Okay. Okay, I sometimes have trouble against... Oh, what's, what's his name? Bow. Sometimes against Chin also. Oh no! Uh... Shin's AI is kind of weird. Sometimes it messes around a lot. I guess that's a drunken master for you. Oh! Oh, wow. Oh, shoot. Why did I run into that? I forgot. Uh. Has Wick actually finished anybody off? She keeps... She doesn't do that much damage, I guess. Keeps leaving people was like a. He had no pixels left there. Okay, bow. Now I. He's almost impossible to read. He just turns into a bouncy powerball. Uh, and then he, he's really good at digging out with kicks. Ah. Shoot. I thought I was dead. Probably a waste. Uh, oh! Oh, I got him. Sweet. Well, it's not a wasted whip after all. Probably. Maybe. Anyway, it felt good. Uh. Oh, that was a cool short hop, but uh, her uppercut's nasty. Okay, Lynn, you can do it, buddy. I don't know how to use you properly, but maybe, maybe Mai doesn't know what to do either, or Athena, sorry. Hey! Oh no, shh. I don't know what to do, that's the problem here. Face that all wrong. Lynn's jumping is short range. Jeez. Ah, that's... That was weird. Whip. Whip was. I got confused. Why did Whip come over to where I was? Okay, well, again, not not great with Lin. Dang it! Yeah. Oh, sorry, Whip. Oh, not go. The sacrifice was in vain. Yeah, the air-to-air. -air but bonk. You are hot this year, my. You saved our butts with with yours. Well, here's the boss. So I I, I never know what to do against the boss. We'll just see how it goes. Once in a while, I actually win. I I don't know why exactly. I all I. I just do jump-ins, basically. Nothing else works consistently that I have found. I suppose it might be a slightly different story with supers turned on, but then again, the boss probably has some awful supers, so, uh, in fact, I, I seem to remember that he does, so... I can't say I really miss... having supers turned on for this fight. Simp. That's a good good vocab there. I 
It's not really aerial. I mean, that, that implies that it's in air. It's actually above the atmosphere, looks like. Estes. <laughs> well, just double pluralify it. Why not? Possessify and pluralify. Throw an apostrophe in there. Get him lucky. Oh, well. Oh. oh. And zero negates my main strategy of rolling. You cannot roll in on zero. He is he is totally on top of rolls. Oh, what, what am I doing? Oh, well, it was better than getting hit by that. Oh my gosh, he's not usually that relentless with his cape spinny thing. So that was not good. That's not a good sign for this fight. Oh my gosh. Y'all try rolling in on him. Nope. Nope. He just grabs you out of it. Oh my gosh. Uh, I should have. Well, Lin continues his useless streak. Sorry, Lin. Okay, I, I may have one chance. Oh no! Oh, nice. Oh shoot. He's just going right through. Yeah. He knew his invulnerability frames. Game over. Oh. Mai, again, doing uh, the lion's share of the work. So, thanks, Mai. If I pause this. No, it doesn't keep the music going. Well, anyway, that was. Uh, so, I got to the boss. Um, good for me. Oh, no, I didn't want to do that. Oh well, now we got this music, which does get a little irritating. So uh, yeah, that, that wasn't too bad. Got to the uh, got to the boss. I don't count on beating the boss. Certainly not on level eight, and actually not on any any level. Not that I played on any other level for ages. But uh, you think I'd know how to beat the boss by now? I do not. Um, I hate fighting bosses, so <laughs> just I don't care enough, I guess. But that's a cheap excuse, isn't it? I, I'm not good enough. That's the real deal. Uh, and I suck with Lin, I, uh, why aren't I better with Lin? I don't know. Anyway, um, he's too weird. Yeah, that's my excuse. Uh, so tomorrow, I think I'm gonna, uh, well, yeah, I, well, bleh. anyway, I think I might do some more, um, Virtue Fighter 5 quest mode, and it would be uh, Pai Chan's turn. The quest mode, uh, she's probably my lowest ranking character. I just don't don't win too many close fights with her or whatever. Um, but uh, she's still been fun to use. I am getting up to the, the difficult part. I mean, up to the ninth Dan or so, and some of my characters are warrior rank, which is uh, two above tenth Dan. So we'll see. We'll see how much farther I can get with Pi. Um. So I think that's what I'll be doing tomorrow. And then uh, day after that, that would be Friday that I play it and then upload it on Saturday. I think I may do some 
fighting EX Slayer. Don't go to sleep on me. Consolized Neo Geo. Uh, some fighting EX Slayer. There's still lots of the cast that I have not even played yet, so looking forward to continuing to explore that. That is a fun game. Um, kind of surprising how much I'm enjoying it. Uh, so, yeah, if, you, if you've not played or seen Fighting EX Lair, uh, you know, give, give it a look. It's pretty pretty solid, actually. And there's no boss in it, so... <laughs> there's no boss. That's probably a big reason why I, uh... I can continue to play, because you don't have to worry about some big cheating jerk face at the end of your arcade run. Uh... Also, it does have a Kumite mode, surprisingly. They, they snuck one into the practice mode. So you can just go and fight to infinity if you want, which is something I appreciate, and more games should have. Actually, I that was how I used to play KOF 2000, because the KOF 2000 in the, the King of Fighters Nest collection for Japanese PS2, in that KOF 2000's practice mode, you can set uh, effectively a kumite mode. It's just one round matches, um, but it will reset the characters when somebody gets KO'd. Or you can even set it to randomize one or the other characters or like have winner stays on. Pretty cool. The, the problem, I stopped playing that version. Well, I, the, the problem there is that like a lot of practice modes in certainly in, in SNK games, um, and in most that I've played, the uh, the difficulty level does not get high enough. Uh, it, it's it kind of stays at like the first first match level of an arcade run AI, so uh, it's just not that tough. So that, that was the main problem. Um, and actually, arcade mode. I don't have a big problem with arcade mode in 2000. The boss is one of the one of the less ridiculous SNK bosses, so sometimes I can beat him, so there's that faint glimmer of hope. And uh, I don't really worry about the boss anyway. It's just a fun run through however many fights you get. The difficulty curve in KOF games was always just pretty pretty good, pretty nice. I liked it, and I think that's the main reason I ended up playing uh, a lot of KOF instead of say a street fighter or something because the the difficulty curve was felt more natural to me and the AI in general felt more natural whereas I just have all these vague memories of of having the impression that the uh, every time I would jump in on the street fighter AI I would just uppercut the heck out of me uh, anyhow I have to get going so thanks again for watching this KOF session KOF 2000 session on uh on MVS, and uh, back with probably some Virtua Fighter 5 Ichan quest mode in the next episode, so uh, stay tuned if you're into that, and then probably some uh, Fighting EX Lair after that, and then, you know, I, I do this, I do some some fighting game every day, so, uh, so uh, chances are there ought to be at least one of these games that you enjoy. Um, I, have, I have narrowed it down to what, uh, I think I've got like 15 or so fighting games now that I'm, I'm playing on a semi-rotating basis, and they're all, they're all, uh, they're all winners as far as I'm concerned. I weeded out all the, all the, uh, all the ones that I just couldn't, couldn't play on a continuing basis for some reason or other, so I'm, I'm pretty happy with the set I've got now. Uh, yeah, yeah, P pretty good games, I think. I mean, KO 2000 was is not regarded as one of the best King of Fighters games, but uh, I guess I have a soft spot for it because it was kind of the one that came out when I was really getting into KOF. And um, uh, I don't know, it just has a cool, um, cool look and feel to it, I guess. And I like the goofy strikers. I, I never played competitively I really just played against the CPU so the fact that the strikers are not balanced at all well that never was a, a big problem for me all right well uh, I'm getting out of here thanks again and good night